Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to export multiple pages from Cold Draw 2017. Uh, you know Corel limits you on to exporting only one page at a time. Uh, let's say you have about 100 pages, definitely you're not going to be able to export one page at a time unless you use the techniques I'm about to show you below. So what you need to do, you need to click on tools, go to macros, uh, run macros, and then uh, on this uh, panel here, we need to go to the macros infield and then select the file converter. You might find that in your instance, uh, your Corel doesn't have the file converter option. Uh, there's a link in the description below where I explain how to add the file converter. It's very easy, but then you can check in the link you can check for the link in the description below for how to add a file converter uh, to your Corel Draw. But let's assume for this time that uh, your file converter is one of the options in Macros In. You need to select File Converter and then click on Run. All right. Now, the two fields that we need to uh, fill in here. The first field is the source field. Uh, what actually this means is the source folder, the folder where your Corel document is saved. The document you're working on, where is it saved? This is the folder we're going to um to locate here this is the folder we're going to browse to browse to all right you click on the browse day mine in this instance is saved on local disk d it's under veros something uh it's under veros whatsapp invitation and then it's this one here remember the folder where your coil document is saved so that's the folder you're going to select here and then the moment you click on it uh corel um this panel will pull all the uh, the files that are in that docu in that folder but the one that we are interested in here is the corel document the document that has your pages so normally corel serves two documents the the backup one and the original one so i'll select the original one and then click on add then from there i'll click okay and now we need to uh, to to fill in the second field here which is the destination so the destination is where corel is going to put all our exported files so in this time in this instance i'm exporting some jpegs this uh, i need these pages to export as jpegs so corel is asking me where are we going to put those files after we export them so we click on this uh, icon here to select where these files are going to be exported to and uh, normally i like to keep them in the same folder as the source folder so i'll just select the same folder but this could be any folder on your file system it depends on which one you want to save them to in my case i just want to save it to the same folder as the one with the source files okay then I, when i when i finish filling in that second field on the third field it's the convert to this is the file type that corel is going to convert uh, your uh, exported uh, images to or exported pages to uh, it's actually asking you what file type do we export it to in my instance i want to export it as jpegs i want to all i want all these pages to be exported as jpegs so i'll select jpeg uh, which is this one here i'll select jpeg and then one more uh, selection we need to do here is uh, we need to check this uh, checkbox here which says save each page as a separate file okay so we need each jpeg i need each jpeg to come out as a separate jpeg i need each page to come out as, as a separate jpeg i need to check this checkbox here so that corel can export each and every page of mine as a separate jpeg and then with that selected that's all all i need to do now is to click on convert and then i will let corel do the rest wait until it finishes file conversion has completed so i just need to click ok which means now if i go to the folder that i selected as my uh, destination folder i should find all my pages in there as separate jpeg files Let, let's just confirm uh i'll go to um where it is it's on d and uh, it's under various whatsapp invitation it's this folder now you can see each and every image in my document is exported as a separate file if i can check one that's one there uh, that's the second one that's the third one so on and so forth so guys that's exactly how you export your pages from corel draw 2007 uh, in one go you export multiple files in one go 
um in that way that was it for today guys if this tutorial was helpful to you please don't forget to show some love uh you can show some love by uh, uh subscribing to the channel the channel is struggling to get a thousand subs so that uh, youtube can release the monetization on the channel which helps the channel keep going so please guys you can support by uh, subscribing to the channel and let us help us make a thousand subs or else you can like the video or else you can share the video that's it for today guys like usual peace i'm out